my laundry room right now doing some laundry. So excuse the boxes and stuff. Um, but I just wanted to tell you guys, um, I've been trying to do more makeup videos and stuff, but something happened. Um, so sometime last week, was it last week? Yeah, sometime last week, um, I bought a new face wash and then like this and like this other stuff that you put on like acne spots and stuff and it's supposed to go away or whatever and so I used the face wash like twice and the acne stuff twice too and then on Saturday um my face started getting like really itchy right here like in this area like my face started getting really really itchy and um I was like, okay, what the hell, well, what could it be, whatever, I didn't really think much of it, I didn't use the face, wait, I think I did, yeah, I think I did use it again that night when I showered, I used the face wash again, and then Monday came around, and I was just like really itchy, and like, like all this area right here, I could feel like rashes on there, like little like little bumps on there and stuff and I was kind of like what the hell so and then I could feel it on this side but not as much it wasn't as much on this side than it was on this side and then like I had like pimples right here like little tiny bumps up here so I thought you know maybe that's just like the pimples or whatever but right here this area all of this area down here to my neck all of this you could feel like like roughness and like the little pimples and stuff so i was kind of like what the hell you know so then i was like okay well i'm probably allergic to that face wash or something so i probably shouldn't use it anymore so i stopped using it um and so it was monday tuesday and wednesday and it still hadn't gone away and i was like okay well oh no on Wednesday, no, on Tuesday, I decided, oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna film, um, a makeup video, a makeup tutorial or whatever, so I filmed it without putting any foundation on, so I would just, like, film my eye area, but I didn't like how it came out, so I didn't upload it, but anyways, after I did my eye makeup, I did my face makeup, and I put foundation and stuff, and after I finished doing my makeup, it just didn't look right. And since I had the ring light on it, it kind of, I couldn't really see it in natural lighting, how it really looked. So I went on, I went to the bathroom and I started looking at my face and you could see, you could visibly see like all the little pimples and stuff all over and it was just so rough and disgusting. It looked like, <sighs> I don't want to be mean, but you know when somebody has like a lot of acne on their face, like, ex like a big amount of acne on their face and they put like a lot of makeup on and like kind of cakes up and then you can see all the texture on their face that's exactly what it looked like it looked horrible it looked disgusting and i was like what the hell so i washed it off and it started burning like right here and right here it started burning so i was like okay what the hell so mommy hmm. what's up <laughs> nothing so wednesday came around and it was still there I wasn't washing my face with that stuff anymore. Obviously, I was using another gentle soap for my face. And it wasn't going away. I was, like, putting... I was, like, spraying on this um, Mario Badescu spray. It had, like, um, aloe vera on it and all this good stuff. And it kind of felt a little better, but it didn't look better. So, Thursday came around, which was yesterday... And I decided, okay, well, I'm going to go to the doctor because this is freaking me out. Um, obviously, had an allergic reaction to that soap or something. And I'm going to go and see what they tell me. And at work, I was using this cream. It's like hydrocortisone or something and for my face. And I put it on and it did feel a little better, but it still wasn't, you know... I still was, I mean, obviously, it was, I was only using it once, but it did feel a little better, 
And then after I got off work, I went to the doctor, to the urgent care. And um, they were like, oh yeah, you probably did have an allergic reaction to that face wash. Um, don't use it anymore. Obviously, I'm not going to use it anymore. Um, and they prescribed me 1% uh, hydrocortisone to apply on my face twice. And they, they're they like, oh, but don't put it on too much because then it'll dry out your face and it'll irritate it more. So, yeah. So that's where I'm at. And yesterday, because she's like, oh, don't put anything on your face. Um, and I was like, oh, can I put lotion on? And she's like, um, something gentle. So I don't have really anything gentle for my face. So I went to Ulta yesterday and I picked up the, I think it's Cetaphil or CeraVe. I don't know, one of those two. And it's like super moisturizing and stuff for your face and it's very gentle. So I picked that up yesterday and I swear to you, once I applied that on my face last night, my face instantly felt so much better. Like, cause- Mommy, what's your name? Nothing, Papa. So, like, once I applied that on my face, because my face felt, um, like, really dry and stuff. It felt super, super dry, accompanied by that rash. So, um, I, I applied it on and it instantly felt so moisturized. Like, it felt like my face was coming back to life. And I applied a bunch of that on. And... Um, it felt really, really good. And then um, I applied it again, and my face felt really, really soft. Like, it didn't even feel like I had that like that rash on there anymore. But, I, you know, I still had it on there. And then this morning I woke up, and my face felt really, really good. It felt much better than it did yesterday, and it felt very, very moisturized. And then um, I applied it again, like, an hour or two after I was awake and I was like okay well my face feels really soft it doesn't even feel like I have that stuff anymore and today I'm going I'm going out today um so I didn't want to go barefaced to go out to eat because it's gonna look like crap so I um I, I moisturized it really well again with the Cerafil or CeraVe I'm not sure which one it is and I applied some conceal. I put on some lashes. I put on my eyebrows, and then I put a little bit of concealer. And I have this Olay moisturizing cream that has um, a little bit of tint to it. So I put that on as well. And then I put a little bit of concealer on like the super red spots. So so far, and I set it a little bit with some powder. And so far, it feels really good. It feels really, really moisturized. I can't really feel the bumps and stuff. And you can't really see all the texture. So, yeah, I'm really happy about that. Um, hopefully, it stays that way throughout the day and it doesn't, like, dry up. But once I get home, I'm definitely going to wash my face off and then put some more of that lotion. Because I feel like it really is doing me a good job. Like, my face feels so moisturized. It's amazing. I'll probably insert a picture so you guys can see. Um, because I definitely recommend it if you have really dry skin. Girl, this is miracle. This will do miracles on your face. I also wanted to do an avocado face mask, but I'll probably do that later on today after I get home because I heard that's really moisturizing for your face and stuff. So yes, that's what I'm hoping for. So that's my horrible tragic story. Um, I haven't been able to wear makeup in a while, and it's pretty sad, because I love wearing makeup, but, yeah. So, the other day, I had asked you guys to, um, send me video suggestions, and one of them was a clean with me video. Um, I don't have much to clean today, other than my son's room. I swear, I clean his room, like, three, hey, turn on the light. I clean his room like three times a week and every time he goes in that room he just makes a mess he makes a bigger mess than it already was he takes out all his toys don't turn on the light he, ta he takes out all the toys from his box and just throws everything everywhere it's it's ridiculous so today I'm gonna clean his room 
once again and I'm gonna take you guys with me. Prepare to see a mess. Look at all the mess he has. He has these two um he has these two toy toy boxes. I put everything back in there, he takes everything back out, he moves the diaper boxes and the wipey boxes. He just throws his clothes everywhere. I have his clothes in the dirty um, hamper right there. He takes it out, he throws it everywhere. In his closet, I have a shoe, a little shoe bin right there. He takes out his shoes, throws them everywhere. Um, those two boxes are to donate and stuff. He throws stuff up here. I don't know how he does it. He messes up his shelves. He puts, he just makes a big faux mess. So, I'm going to clean this up and we'll show you. that way right so I can see mm -hmm. <laughs> he's mad because I brushed his hair but this is the final look of his room it's nice and clean mopped sweet and everything now let's see how long I just slept 